Welcome back to NGD Replace Super Smash Brothers Melee. Featuring myself, Spencer, my co-host, Matt. I'm playing as Samus. Matt's playing as Falco. We're here live on twitch.tv slash TV. Midway through, we're doing a best of five. Okay, like that definitely ate like all my inputs. Is poor priority a thing in uh, Ultimate? No. That's a hardware limitation, right? Yeah, kind of, I think. Oh, I like fell oh, way far. I know what you're thinking. Did he use my bomb to get out of the hit stun for the back air? I did. Nice. You know what's funny? Is I didn't even think that. What, what I thought was, oh, my bomb hit him. That helped him out. Not that I didn't even like consider that it was planned. Or that it could have been like intentional. I can't really say it's planned because like no way for you to you, you can only react to that really. <laughs> yeah, I kind of drifted into it. The main thing about it is uh, what you do after you get hit by it, really. Oh, my God. No. slowest double lasers it might have actually been so slow it would uh, it, it, it just became a single laser oh that was way too soon damn it i thought i could yeah that in Personally, yeah, I'd that one away. Thank you. 
like his up air is like so weird that it sometimes it doesn't even feel like it hit you yeah should have been better like I felt good I don't know like what, what really sucks about that is that that stage is like really fun as 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 a uh, Samus and fade forward. I need to like STI that into the stage? Yeah. Oh, because I've just been like smash GI. Oh, I sh do I need to ASDI it with like the C stick? No. Oh, okay. So I I'm just missing the timing then. I didn't realize I was like already in my last stock. Jesus. I thought I took stocks. I 
nice. <laughs> he canceled it. Nice. Yeah, that way. <laughs> I, f I, I uh, dropped through the platform, then he hit me right at the, at the same moment. And I guess enough of my body was was through it that I didn't bounce off the platform anymore. Oh, you see that movement I just did? No, I was. I saved my double jump and I, I wall jump and then double jump backwards on the stage like I was fucking Falcon for a second. For a fucking dash attack two and yours one is dumb. Shit, once again, the movement I wanted. <laughs> like, 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 my Some high octane shit. Yeah, my my thumb locked up from 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 uh uh, just like nerves. <laughs> like <laughs> when we're, we're on the side platform after all that other stuff, I just wanted to run off real quick. And you see, I like stutter and I don't even move. Like my thumb was like paralyzed <laughs> from just the crazy shit. Game one Yoshi story. to go for the down tilt instead of the uh, the down air because I would have just landed on Randall. You know? Yeah. Yeah. Sakurai. Oh, fuck. No. Curse you, Sakurai. Oh, 
Oh shit. Dreams game two. God damn it. The perfect plan. Why'd you have to roll? Dreamland. Game three. I had to wipe my fucking hand off. Fucking dodge that shit like you were a ninja. <laughs> Sixty 
That beat cancel definitely saved you. Yeah. Very few situations where that actually happens. That was one of them. Oh, fuck. Yeah, you scared me out of it, dude. Yeah, I mean, it's close. Yeah, most like most even matchup we've had. I think Falco, Fox all day. <laughs> well, that's not like an insult. No, no, you said Falco both... Fox. Oh, Falco <laughs> Samus. Yeah. All right. So I took you to Yoshi's story. Here, here's my plan. You didn't actually take me to Yoshi's story. I picked Yoshi's story. I mean, I took you to Yoshi's what, story. Did you socially engineer me? I did. Yeah. Damn it! Uh, I mean, why wouldn't you pick it over Battlefield? Yeah. So my plan was, okay, we're moving pretty, pretty quick, in the previous games. So I was like, okay, if I go into Yoshi's story, I have a good chance to maybe not win, but keep the the the, the high octane nature up, right? And then, um, and you know, who who knows? Because, like, Yoshi's story uh, when... Can be volatile. Well, when I get you off stage, it, I can definitely gimp stocks. It's possible. You know, just run off there and stuff like that. Those situations didn't happen as much as I wanted it to, but whatever. And then I was like, Literally okay. do that every stage. Yeah. Uh, but in Yoshi's story, it's, like, really... It's, like, easier because of the last zones. Um, it, it feels easier. I don't know why. Also, the, the platform's really low, so it's really easy to do stuff. Um, and then I was like, okay, after Yoshi's story... I'm going to take him to FOD because it's another small stage, but it's more in my favor and I might do well on that. And then I was like, okay, after I take him to two, to two small, really fast stages, I'll take him to a bigger stage and slow everything down a little bit and see if that gives me some, some room to maneuver. Cause maybe, maybe I might be able to make you a little, a little more hungry than usual and I can take advantage of it. I don't know how much of that actually happened or if I just thought, yeah, that's going to happen. And then I just happened to do well on Dreamland anyways. You know, like, I don't know how much of that came true. But that was my plan was to have two small stages that I might lose. But then I, I might get like a I might get a win on Dreamland and then I could I could switch it around. Um, that was my, my game plan with that. Oh, Yoshi, sorry, two minutes and 26 seconds. I took one stock. You uh, rolled once, air dodge four times, swap dodge three times. I air dodge once because I only have one stock. And, you know, usually I air dodge off stage trying to recover. So that's where my one air dodge went. You had 14 inch ones. I had five. You had five counter hits. I had 10. Uh, you had you wave landed four times. I wave landed once. Your inputs were 308.2. Mine were 274.4. It's crazy because I felt like I was moving faster than that. But I think most of it was me getting hit. So 
Uh, in fact, yeah, look at those percentages. Uh, you came with a down air, a neutral air, a back air, and then a back air. And, I, and you killed yourself at 109. I didn't even actually kill you. It's funny. You had a 91% combo on my first stock. You had a 53% combo on my second stock. A 50% combo on my third. And then a 40% combo followed by a 38% combo on my last stock. I got mostly single hit <laughs> things the whole time. Final Dreams, 2 minutes and 20 seconds. I, I think it was, it was, I almost took two stocks. Right? I think so. Um, and, uh, dude, I love Final Dreams. Like, sometimes it's just really fun with, with, uh, with, with Samus. Because, like, the platforms, when I'm not playing against Falco as much, I have more of a chance to do this. But when the platform's, like, really low, I actually can't drop through missile so i have to run off missile right uh, but there's this thing that i think sometimes happens where you're not sure if i'm going to drop through or run off and like i think one time against fox i did a runoff missile backwards in a tiny little space and you, it's it's like it's hard to do so it's not something that you would necessarily expect me to do and i just like that stuff like the different heights and wavelands and all that shit it's just fun anyways i took one stock um, you rolled five times, uh, air dodge twice, I rolled once, air dodge four times, and spot dodge once. You had 16 neutral ends, I had six. You had four counter hits, I had six. Uh, you had three wave lands, I had six. I'm just kidding, I had two. Um, inputs 313.6, mine was 267.6. You come in with two forward smashes, a down air, a and two forward smashes, two down airs. And then I killed you with a side B at 87%. You had a 73% combo on my first stock. A 44 followed by a 53% combo on my second stock. I had a 35% combo on your first stock. Nice. And then on my last stock, you had a 55% combo. And here comes the, 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 the coup de grace. The penultimate... Well, actually, this is the ultimate game. Penultimate's the one before the ultimate. Anyways. Yeah. Um, the fun one. The <laughs> you uh, It was 3 minutes and 58 seconds, almost 4 minutes. You rolled 3 times, air dodge once, spot dodge once. It's crazy that, like, even then... I air dodged 15 times. Spot dodge twice because I started using air dodge to avoid your kills. So I can extend my life. And it, it works, I mean, for the most part. Dude, we were like, it's one of those like situations where the, 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 the tension was so high that we were both like, like you started to really back off and just try to like laser so you could get me into a down tilt scenario or, or something like that. Um, and I was like, you got to keep the pressure on, dude. You, you, I can't let you ha just like rest in this situation, but I also got to not kill myself on you. Oh boy, it was crazy. You had 20 neutral ones, I had six. Yeah. You had six counter hits, I had 11. And you had one beneficial trade. No wave lines for you, I had eight. You did have, you actually didn't have that many uh, movement options. 15 wave dashes, 39 dash chances. I had 35 wave dashes and 13 dash chances. I mean, puts, like, I feel like I dash dance a lot more than that. Yeah. I don't know. And here, what's interesting is, like, my my internal, like, game plan was fast, fast, slow. But then, which worked for you, but for me, I did the opposite. I moved much faster. I, like, inputs per minute here, 316, whereas before I was, like, 270 around there for both those last games. And you went down by, like, 20. Uh, yeah. Um... But you did kill me with a forward smash, a neutral B, a neutral B, and then a down tilt. Um, but you killed me with lasers? Oh, that's right, because yeah. you were sniping my shit. Um, and I could do the side B. I, I probably would have won this if you didn't get one of those snipe things where you fucked up my, my bombs. It was that close. I could do the side B, a forward smash, and then a side B. And like the percentages are like so low. Crazy. Yeah, I got gimped twice. You had a 53% combo on my first stock. I had a 46% combo, uh, like, yeah, you, you had a 34% one in one second. No, well, it, in it, four seconds. It says zero to three. No, it says zero to oh, 0. 0.4. I was looking at the percentages, zero to 34%. Yeah, so, so four seconds, and then uh, right after that. Uh, and laser, laser. Yeah. Laser, laser, and then I had my 46% combo. The first time I hit you. <laughs> uh then on my second stock, you had a 70% combo to, to, to close out the second stock. On my third stock, you had a 96% combo to close out that stock. I had a 36% combo to close out your sec your third stock. Um, oh, sorry. Yeah, you, you your third stock. And then on my last stock, you had a 47% combo. And then that didn't quite get it done, so then it was another 28% combo. 
Fun games. Yeah, a lot of fun. It was one of those where neither of us were talking, but I like uh, as much. But and, and it wasn't just because we didn't have something to say. I feel like we were like really focusing. Sometimes that happens where like we won't say anything and I'll be aware of it a little bit. And other times it happens to me all the time during Hades. Mm. I'm like I haven't said anything in a, in a while. And I've noticed I'm, then I'm like, did I talk? Yeah. What, what do I talk about? My uh, biggest blah 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 blah. blah. <laughs> My biggest uh, critique with that is you gotta you gotta say what you're reading and you gotta say what you're doing, like what your plan is. You gotta lay out like what you're. I mean, sometimes I try to do that. Yeah. When, and, when there's a room choice or something like that. Right. Yeah. I just know that sometimes you'll be in a menu and then you'll look at it and they go, hmm, and then you'll make a choice. And like he could have like said what the options were and which one he was picking, but you know, it's yeah. the only thing that I, should probably, I think would would yeah. probably. Uh, uh, spice it up a little bit and it would put you, put you in a mindset of talking more often anyways good idea that's literally like uh when i was doing the enter the gungeon streams i literally talked about absolutely everything and just tried to keep saying stuff and talking about what was happening and then like it it, it, it got kind of bad though because then if i had if i didn't say something for like four seconds it felt like an eternity went by and, I, and i'm like oh my god I gotta keep saying stuff, or else it's boring. So like, I had kind of the op the, the slightly negative effect of that, unfortunately. But it's a it's a fine line of of being a little bit comfortable with having some silence, but also, you know, continuing to be engaging. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, and all that. Anyways, all right, we're talking about melee. Um, good games, They're fun. Uh, two good foxes, two good falcos. Yeah, one and a half good. Damus is one and a half out of four ain't bad. Yeah, yeah. I mean, especially since you were playing pretty well. And uh, I think what made this so much fun was that um, this last best of five is I think we went through a couple of different like meta approaches within it as far as like neutral game and all that. Mm -hmm. I thought that was cool. Um, but uh, yeah, any other thoughts? Nope. Name for the episode? Just a good melee day. Just a good melee day. If that's too long, I'll shorten it. Good but yeah. melee day. Good melee day. Okay. So we're going to call this a stream. Thanks everyone so much for coming in. Thanks, Cream TV, for hanging out. Thank you, Flores, for coming in and Nimba. Um, it always messes with me because he used to be Nimbus. I digress. Uh, we'll be back on throughout the week. Matt might be playing some Hades. We might do some other stuff. Literally, it's based on a whim. Um, but uh, yeah, for those of you on YouTube, check us out live on Twitch.tv slash TV, and we'll see everybody next time. Peace.